Hello everybody, this is a video about a safe pushpin stand. This is a pushpin. These are usually stored in boxes like this one. So notice the snap fit right here. So if you're not careful trying to open this box, you, know, you may spill down pins. So a pin like this on the loose is definitely not a good thing. So this gave me an idea to come up with a new design which is safe and efficient to store these push pins. So I've created a new prototype right here uh, which is a hollow hemispherical dome and I've just mounted you know these push pins right on the surface of the dome. So I have drilled nine holes on the surface uh, because I intended to store nine push pins. You can drill as many holes as you want based on the number of pins you want to store. So what is the procedure to store and remove pins? Well it's quite simple. All you gotta do is take a push pin and you know like just insert it in the hole and turn clockwise twice. You know this ensures that the pin is intact and will not fall down you know, when I tilt it. And similarly to remove the push pin all you gotta do is you know, turn the push pin counterclockwise twice, and there you have it, you know, ready to be used. So, this procedure of turning clockwise and counterclockwise is followed just to ensure that, you know, like it's easy and quick to access the push pin at the same time they're safe and they don't fall down. One of the most important parameters here is the diameter of the hole. So, the diameter of the hole should be slightly greater than the push pin diameter but too large of a hole diameter may not hold the push pin you know uh, when, when we tilt it or in any other orientation so what are the advantages and disadvantages of this model the advantages are like you know it's safe uh, and reliable like you know uh, you can store as many push pins as you want and they're all safe you know they're not going anywhere else and uh, the other advantage is like, you know, the pins, uh, you know, you, you can segregate uh, the push pins based on color. So you can, you know, if you want green color, you can just pluck right from here. So, well, you know, in this case, it, it, you got to like dig in and search for a while. Uh, that, is, that is one of the advantages. And this advantage is like the user needs to be patient enough to you know like store and remove pins and you need two hands to access this you can't do it with one hand so you, you either have to mount the hemisphere or hold it all right i hope you enjoyed this video thank you for watching have a nice day